Hi guys, happy Valentine's Day! I'm wearing my pink glasses to commemorate the holiday. So I have a box to share with you guys. Um, it's actually my last month of Stars Hollow monthly. Um, I went ahead and discontinued it because it was one of my more expensive um, subscription boxes and I just got engaged over the Christmas holidays and I need to save money for a wedding. Um, so I'm gonna show you this, but before I do that, I when I was shopping for Valentine's gifts for my fiance, I was walking through Target and I found this little section that has all these little action figure type things. And this one, everyone meet Gideon. <laughs> Sorry about that, he's so nosy. But um, this, it's like little vinyl figure um, that's Harry Potter themed and it's a mystery mini. So there are quite a few possible characters that I could get. Now I've not opened it yet so I'm really curious. Um, it doesn't feel like one of the smaller ones because there's like Nagini and Crookshanks and Dobby and um, McGonagall's like um, Animagus, but it feels, I don't know, I don't, I've never gotten one of these before. Um, I have ordered a type of product like this off of Amazon before, and it was, um, I'm drawing a blank on the name, Nightmare Before Christmas, and it was really cute, but I had never gotten this Harry Potter one, so it came in this little black bag. Um, and, oh, look at that. See, I don't know what I'm talking about. I actually did just get um, scabbers. Um, so that's kind of a disappointment because to me, this little figurine, without the rest of the set, there's no, like, it doesn't look relevant to the series at all. So, um, honestly, I'm probably going to throw this away. Um, it was only like $2 for the box. But they did have a lot more, so I might buy another one because I would really like it. Like to get, like there's Dumbledore and Fox and McGonagall, and I would really like to get those few. Or Hedwig. And of course there's Crookshanks, which just looks like a little orange cat. And if I got, if I got Crookshanks or the little tabby cat, I would definitely just keep those. See, down here at the bottom and down here at the top. Okay, well, that's that. So now I'm gonna get to the main point of this video, which is my Stars Hollow Monthly. And it came in a different box this month. I actually didn't know what it was until I read the label, and it's from Lit Cube. It's never come in a box this shape before. So I went ahead and cut the um, packing tape um, when I opened it. It has this nice, like, burgundy colored tissue paper. Okay, so there's an apology letter on top, and it says, it's on a little postcard, it says, you've been Gilmore. It says, we apologize, you got a plain box this month. One of your Stars Hollow items was too big and awesome to fit in our pretty boxes. So that's, I guess, why the box looks so different. Um, okay, so I have the little card that looks like the Luke's um, diner menu. On the back, there's actually an advertisement for gypsies. Um, on the inside, there's an advertisement for Kim's Antiques. That's cute that they're changing it up every time. And then, as usual, the middle tells what all the items are. I'm not going to look at that. But it also has um, some hashtags to use when you share. There's Gideon again. Some hashtags to use, as well as um, their website. And it looks like they have a coffee club, like a Stars Hollow coffee club that you can join. Like, have, they'll mail you different flavors of coffee related to the series. Cool. Um, anyway, so here are the actual products. So first thing, and this is actually pretty cool, I waited to open this. It's like a little um, Valentine, like a um, Gilmore Girls themed one. It says, I love you, you idiot. I'm actually going to take the sucker out. 
came with two holes in it to be able to stick the, the sucker stick down in. And it's a really cute design. If I had the option of buying like a set of these, I would definitely do that and give them to like coworkers or friends or something. But I also got a really awesome Jolly Rancher lollipop and it's watermelon flavored, which is the best flavor. So that's cool. Um, let's see. Oh, this has a cool stamp on the front. I wish I had this stamp. It says Stars Hollow Monthly and just like cute little writing. And inside, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. So on one, it's in like one of these sealed plasticky sleeves. Okay, so on one side, there are these little stickers. I'm assuming they're probably like planner stickers. Um, but you have like ones where you can write a list. You have ones where you can like star the side of your planner entry, more lists. Then there's little, it says to do little things, odds and ends, remember. And then it even has little individual stickers that has a money sign. Um, so like for payday, when to go out to eat, when you're going on like a coffee date, um, when a certain TV show is on and when to go grocery shopping. Let me see if I can get that closer to you. Lighting is terrible. Ooh. Okay, that's a little better. And then there's like, that looks like Suki, just a little cute decorative sticker. And then one with Rory and Lorelai. Stumbled through that. And it says, I drink coffee like a Gilmore girl. And then on this side, there's just little tiny stickers of all the main characters, including the three I already said, plus Lane, Dean, um, Jess, and Luke, and even Paul Inca. Um, I'm assuming that's Dean. Doesn't look quite rich enough to be Logan, but, um, doesn't look tall enough to be Dean either, but actually none of them, they're all the same height. Like, Lane isn't short, so, it, yeah, I think that's Dean. But the other thing that came in this package that I'm so excited about is a magnetic bookmark and it is in the design of Lane and I think I could have gotten any of those characters which is I mean Lane's cool I don't dislike Lane but I wish I could have gotten like Rory or Jess or Lorelai uh, or Paul Inca that would have been awesome but this is so cute like even with Lane is precious I need to get a better camera so it will actually focus on the products one day. So it's from, it says Man Ma Magnetic Bookmarks and Planner Stickers from Nerdy Girl Designs. It's an Etsy shop, so you can also find them on Etsy and Instagram. And yeah, Nerdy Girl Designs. So I'm definitely going to be using this probably like in just a bit because I just started Lauren Graham's new book, Talking As Fast As I Can, and it's already awesome. Okay, next thing. So I have some cute socks, nice and long, and it says oil with the poodles already, across the top in like pink and white with a little poodle. Um, and they're just, I mean, your normal quality sock, like little, like, like nothing crazy, but I wear these kinds of socks all the, all the time. It's really the only type of sock that I wear. So I'm excited to add these to my collection. Um, quite an avid sock collector. Okay, the next thing is, let's see, it looks like maybe a pen with a sticker on it. So the pen is in the shape of like a turquoise, almost see-through type design umbrella that's like um, snapped down and it has a sticker on it that says you jump I jump Jack which is from the episode where Rory first gets her look or gets her first look at the um, oh my gosh I'm drawing a blank on Logan's little club thing y'all see Gideon walking up there <sighs> y'all he's the worst cat in the world <laughs> anyway um 
the life or death brigade and so it's a cool little sticker that I'll probably put like on my plan or something and I think the just dropped it hang on let me get that it looks like a pen Ugh. but I can't get the top off like it's not a click pen I don't think I don't want to pull it too hard and break it I might have to get like Justin to play around with this and um, see if it is in fact a pen and I'll just let you guys know um, well, positive, you won't ever lose the cap, <laughs> but you might not get to write with it either. Um, but I'm sure it's just, once you snap it off the first time, it will be a lot easier to work with. But I would definitely use this. I love crazy pens. And it's umbrella. Like, it's an obscure reference to the series, so people wouldn't necessarily assume this is Gilmore Girls without some sort of label. Okay, and the last thing that I've been eyeballing this whole time, I think it's the last thing, and the reason why I got a crazy box is this nice leather bound, it's probably, I mean, yeah, it's like a fake leather, but still, it's very nice, like a squishy fake leather that says Luke's Menu on the front, it has a magnetic clasp, and I don't know what's in it but it's awesome. Okay, so first it has like a little um, space to be able to put your ID and different like credit or debit cards and a pouch to be able to put papers or probably it's meant to put money in. Um, so I'm guessing this could be like just a little booklet you carry around instead of a purse like if you're going to the library or something like that. There's also a little tab on the back where you can stick a pen or a pencil for when you're traveling and there's a paper on the front that says it has all the rules from Luke's um, diner no texting while ordering no man buns no taking pictures of food no headphones and if I can hear your music or yeah if I can hear your music through your headphones why are you wearing headphones <laughs> so just typical crabby Luke stuff um, it is a really nice what what I Again, I still don't know what is in here, but bear with me. I am able to push the little tabs down and open these up so that if I decide not to use oh, it's a planner. Oh my gosh. If I decide to not use this planner, which I will, but one day I'm just going to run out of paper, I can replace it with paper or um, my own little notebook so that I can always use this. Okay, so this is a planner. Oh my gosh. And it starts out by just giving you blank, like, days of the week with a little grid to kind of customize it exactly how you need to so that you could, like, number it based on the month you start on. It doesn't give you months. And as you flip through, then you get, like, just a general notes page. This aligned notes page. And then it starts says a week to week so it's still very similar to me though I mean it still has the days of the week across the top um, just a slightly different design but um, I'm fine with that too um, okay, it's still the same thing I guess it does that all the way to the back and then it gives another more extended notes, just lined notes section. And this is going to be really convenient because like I mentioned earlier, I did get engaged over the Christmas break and I am planning a wedding, which side note is not that much fun. It's very stressful, time consuming. People are not very nice about it. I might do a rant video about it next week, but right now I'm too irritated. To want to talk about it more than I have to. Um, not very much fun and I've always planned on having an October wedding but that's not going to work out anymore. Instead we have settled on a date. We're going to do it June 3rd which actually is pretty relevant to Gilmore Girls. Um, it was kind of a coincidence but um, comment below if you know the relevance of June 3rd to Gilmore Girls. But that's when I'm going to get married now 
and this is going to be great to plan out to have now a notebook specific to planning out my wedding I had been just putting notes and dates and things like that in my regular calendar which I already or my regular planner which I already use for my life and for school like my job working at the school and it it's just too much I need I need it to be separated because it's getting too cluttered so now I can have a Gilmore Girls one and when things get stressful I can at least remember that Gilmore Girls is never ever stressful um, okay well that's it I did have another package that I wanted to show you of some other planner stickers that I bought that were Halloween themed but I don't remember where I put them so when I find them I'll stick them onto another video because it's not enough to do a whole video over but um, that is it I hope you're having a wonderful Valentine's Day and I will talk to you soon bye